description. I'm gonna be taking a break from Layers of Fear after this video and I'm gonna be playing and recording Mortal Shell. I saw Otsdarva playing this game and it looked a lot of fun. I really like, you know, Souls-like games, so I'm, I think I'm gonna enjoy it. So, a few of you have asked me, why? Why, Matt? Why have you stopped uploading, you know? Did you give up on the channel? Um, do you just don't want to do it anymore? And the answer is, I was busy. I was really busy with uh, with work, and I was working really hard, um, pretty much all week. And during the weekends, I kind of didn't want to edit, and so pff, I didn't do it. But now I, I feel like I want to, so I'm getting back on track. There it is. That is the only reason. It was just about work, okay? Just about work. Nothing else, no crazy game, you know, nothing. Just work. In a world full of bosses. Traps. Music. And frogs. There's only one skin crawler that can save us all. This is the story of our hero, our savior. This is the beginning of the incredible adventures of Matt Stellar in the amazing realm of Mortal Shell. After getting my ass handed to me by the tutorial boss, I was followed by a big fish and went out to explore the world. The first reward of my journey comes in form of a shell. And as any skin crawler would do, I possessed it, so I wouldn't die of cold in the next 5 seconds. After touching a rock, I received the vision of a place I probably must go to. But since I'm in a foreign land, I kinda need assistance finding my new objective. I'm not sure asking those guys is a good idea. You there? Oh, hi. What do you want? Is there any tower around here? A tower? It is just on your left. Now give me your money, boy! Yeah! After this unjustified act of violence, I had no other choice but go into a rampage. And I was on a rampage until I got sloppy and got pushed out of my shell. And let me tell you kids, it's a cold world out there. I was really lucky being able to get back in my shell before the enemy killed me because holy shit I don't have any health. But my strength prevailed, I mean of course it did. I would never die to a trash mob like this, who do you think I am, some scrub? Not here! After getting my revenge by killing that filthy, disgusting bard, I learn about the use of traps. And killed some frogs. Making myself Peter's most wanted criminal. After that, I've arrived at Falgrim Tower. A place where I would meet my two new allies. But before I met my allies, I found visions of weapons. Scattered around the world, 
just waiting for me to put them to good use. Behind the weapon wall there was a giant bird, but oh, he was all locked up. Poor thing couldn't even breathe, so I went ahead and removed the smallest thing possible to help him. And also, after speaking to the bird upstairs, I went down and found Sester Ganesha, my second new ally. Pray, what wayward spirit beckons? And she called me Foundling. That's kinda cute, right? After talking to her, I found out that my shell's name was Harrows, the Vassal. After that discovery, I went out and... Wait, whose roar is this? Okay, I gotta find out. And that, my friend, is how I met Grisha, the first boss. I wasn't really expecting to be a boss in there, I saw, you know, I mean, there was an arena, but for me it was just a big mob, you know? But I entered and I saw the health bar and I was like, holy crap, okay, I'm not ready for this. Oh my god, so slow, oh my shell! Holy crap, my HP is so low, Grisha, Grisha, please let me, let me have my shell back, come on, man, don't be like this, oh my god, please! Woo! Come on, man, stop it, oh, holy shit, I'm almost dead, okay, look, I resolve charges, which means that there is a way for me to heal. Time to use my special ability. Get sealed, bitch! Get sealed, bitch! Get sealed, bitch! Get sealed, bitch! Oh, and that thing! I saw it in one of my visions! Okay, come on. Let's finish this big boy. Oh my god! Hold on, is that is that Krisha? Okay, I really need that weapon now. Ow! I've encountered many enemies along the way, but not a single one of them was able to match my secret technique. After arriving at the temple grounds, I found a mace and a book that whispered to me the new Call of Duty secrets, Subscribe to unspeakable seller. powerful secrets. Holy shit, is that- no, no, not there, not there, get this thing away from me, please! Ah, uh, uh, <sighs> uh, am I- am I dead? Ah, uh, wait, Hattern? The, the boss from the tutorial? Oh no 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 no, come on man! Holy shit! Ow! Alright, let's go ahead and get see Ow! Shit! Ow! Holy shit, wait, what? Is this, is this phase 2? Come on, please don't be phase 2. Please don't be phase 2, man, come on! Now, uh, oh shit! Holy crap, my health! Yeah, that was an embarrassing death. I didn't even get higher to the half health. But don't worry, it did happen again. And again. And again. Each time I came back, I had to ask myself two questions. Should I call the worm fish? And where the hell is my shell? Oh, okay, it's right there. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, got it. Hey, how you doing, baby? That is back. It's gonna take real good care of you. Let's go, Heather. Eh. After that last death, I got so frustrated. 
I couldn't keep doing this. I needed to come up with a strategy. So I did. I came up with the safe strategy of baiting his hardening, waiting it out, then charge with a jump attack, get a few hits, and then use hardening to defend myself from his attacks. And that's it. That's a pretty safe strategy. Using the strategy, look at his HP, man. Holy crap, he's almost dead. Come on, just charge, get a few hits. How did he hit me? Okay, now he's on fire, need to judge. Okay, bait, 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 gotta bait. And boom, to bait it. Put some distance, run, charge, hit, defend. Get a few hits, he's 1 HP, I got hit too, I'm on fire, holy crap, I need to wait, I need to wait, bait hardening, bait, 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 and there it is, he's done, victory is mine, <laughs> you fucking bitch, <sighs> finally, come on Wormfish, eat him, eat his ass, come on, let's go, finally, wait, what? Header? What the hell? What? <gasps> Finally, after that hard and terrible fight, I had obtained my smoldering mace. But that's not the end. Will I be able to beat Grisha? Will I find some other shells? Will I finally become the greatest skin crawler in the land? Find out in the next videos. Thank you all so much for watching, thanks for my friend Guilherme to voice in the, the thug in the swamp, it was, that, it was really helpful. And uh, keep being stellar everybody.